Hello, everybody, and hey. welcome to the first live glass case of emotion podcast on NASCAR.com. I'm Chuck Bush. I'm it's, Kim Coon. And, and I'm Clint Boya. And we're yeah. Yeah, we're missing somebody. Yeah, somebody's missing. Where's Bullet? We've got an empty couch over here. He's gonna be late. We have to give him a really hard time when he gets here. Yeah. It's not like he's got you know, a busy he, weekend or anything going yeah, on. Yeah, nothing else going no, on. No, no, no. Those uh, they were bowling last night, pretty late. Uh, I guess there's a bowling alley. You didn't in here get somewhere. invited? No, they came by my bus looking for some stuff, and then they went bowling and some stuff. I didn't get invited. <laughs> yeah. Some drinks. Some drinks. Some drinks. You didn't get the were... invite. No. We invited you here, though. We've been That's invited. when you know you're getting old when all the kids come by and, hey, you got any, you got any stuff in your cupboard? You you any cupboard? And then they just either. leave. They don't They don't invite you or anything. Well, we've been inviting you to be on the podcast for a really long time, and you only just now decided, oh, sure, I'm already at track, so I'll, it's convenient. What is a podcast, anyway? It, it's It's this. It's people sitting around talking Shooting into microphones. The I like it. Yeah. And then like people it. download it and listen to it. I dig it. You guys listen to it, right? You got a whole crowd full of glass holes. Yeah, we got a sign <laughs> out there. Established Aww. March 1st, 2017. I'm pretty uncomfortable saying that word. That you're a glass hole? Yes. It's not a bad word. It's pretty close. It means it's close. <laughs> Close. We, they did. They did say. Now on iTunes, we have a explicit oh, yeah. rating. It's literally so this is the family two friendly letters version. away from being really bad. Well, if you were to come in studio, you can cuss all you want. Oh, but, but not here. Not here. not here. No, you can't. Actually, yeah. I'm in big trouble right now for cussing. Uh, we had that first moment when my two and a half year old repeated you. I messed up. Which big word? Time. Yeah, so I know you can't it say was, it. What does it begin with? It was not a. Vo- <laughs> 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 Shouldn't have happened. It was. It was a big deal. Mama was not impressed. Was it used in the proper context? Absolutely perfect, too. And I was like, so you, what do you do? Is it you kind of turn around and laugh? But you're like, oh, you're not supposed to do that. (laughs) Yeah, that's what happened this week. That was a new development. So got to mind my uh, P's and Q's. Q's. And can't say glass hole. Glass hole is way too close, Kim. Glass hole is not a bad word. No, it's, it's, it's like a hand-blown glass that you can buy in the mountains of North Carolina. You know, a nice vase, maybe. Yeah, glassware. Yeah, I don't even know what you're like. People, have, what are you people talking have started about? yelling at the track, glass hole, which if you don't know what is it means. Is this a fun racetrack to be at or what? <laughs> it is. Ah. Such a cool racetrack. The size, uh, it's that short track feel, you know, when you're out there on the racetrack, but it's big enough. You get that sensation of speed as a fan and even as a driver. I uh, always liked this place from the first time I came here. And uh, there's literally, that's the toughest barbecue truck I think I've ever seen in my life. Oh, if wow. In case you guys haven't ever seen ADD uh, on display, that's what happened right there. This is what happened. I was down the road of talking about the racetrack, <laughs> looked up, and it's the biggest <laughs> barbecue truck I've ever seen. It I looks mean, that, like an apocalypse vehicle. I hope my car acts just like that truck's capable of driving tonight. I I run over the competition. If they're faster, I'm just going to run them over. I I feel like that barbecue truck would survive the zombie apocalypse. What? A zombie apocalypse. That would survive a a zombie apocalypse. You could have all the pork you wanted. I don't know what you're talking about. You've never heard of a zombie. I'm new to uh, podcasts. You've never heard of a zombie apocalypse. This podcast vocabulary? we just talk. Yeah. You've never heard of a zombie apocalypse? No. Ever. Have you not seen any movies or TV shows? Not on (laughs) sci-fi. Are you making fun of me? Yes. <laughs> Movies are real, Clint. Movies are real. Yeah, apparently. You didn't see uh, World War Z with Brad Pitt. Shaun of the Dead. You don't. You don't see anything. No. What's the uh, What's a really popular one? Uh, not, the Walking Dead. Walking Dead. Nine the of the walk- Living Dead. All of the dead things. Yeah. <laughs> I try to live. <laughs> I want to live. You weirdos. Who watches dead <laughs> movies all the time? You don't want to watch a bunch of dead people. I like l- real life people. Look at these people out here. This is my kind of people. Not a bunch of dead zombies. Clint's of course, I have seen a zombie. <laughs> that guy, I don't that know. Guy, You're pretty close to looking like one over there. I can't see his eyes. I don't know. I'm teasing. I like that. I like uh, a fan that gets into, uh, you know, into the... Into the groove and into the vibe, and, and that's what it makes. Painted. Yes, it I'm a huge of, Chiefs fan, and actually, I thought you were celebrating colors. that Chiefs uh, victory over the Pats Thursday night. Ah. Yes, that was awesome. That was way awesome. You're not a Patriots fan, are you? No, I'm a Panthers fan. I cheered for the Panthers. Did they win? Do they even play? Do they have a team anymore? Yes. 
I thought they, they just opened a clothing line and celebrate their weird clothes that they wear all the time. Oh, Cam? Yes, that's I, who I, I was will, talking yes, about. Yes, Cam does wear, wear weird clothes. Yes, I'll hit his give head you that. too many times. That's what happens. When you know you've the, had too many concussions when you start wearing clothes like that. But when was this the last time that the Chiefs were in the Super this Bowl? This isn't on any kind of anything that people can hear us talking about them, is it? It is. It is. It is. It is. It's on NASCAR.com. It's like your Facebook page or something? It's going to be on Facebook. You can it download is. it in iTunes. It's going to be everywhere. All right. Why is there anything it's gonna you want to tell forever. the people? I don't like cam suits. Okay. But I was asking you, when's the last time the Chiefs have been to the Super Bowl? Oh! Oh, oh my God! Oh, hey! Oh. oh, hey! Hey, guy! How's it going? Oh, you oh. don't like us? We have cooties? Where have you been? Sure hope it doesn't. <laughs> Well, we've covered, uh, we've, we have glass holes out there, and uh, there's one over there. And then zombies are a real life thing, if you ask these two. Yes, I didn't know that. My mic on? Yeah, it's, we can hear you. Okay. You need to speak up. I, a little more energy. Possible. Yeah, yeah. There's zombies here. <laughs> zombies. <laughs> there's zombies. I've only the been one so far. Oh, wow. We found That's, one. Uh, Clint nice doesn't know what a paint. podcast is, apparently. Or a zombie. Or for a that zombie. Matter. He has no idea. Well, or a, a podcast zombie is... apocalypse. Is that a what you said? A zombie apocalypse yeah. where the zombies take over the world. Thing. It is. It's going to happen. See? What the Eventually. Are you a survivalist? Do you prep for... Are you a prepper? I'm not like a prepper. I'm not like Carl Edwards prepper, but, you know, that, you got to have go. some stuff. He was a survivalist. How does yeah. one prep for a zombie... What is it? A zombie apocalypse. Yeah, how did you Run. prep for that? We Practice got, running. Did you guys see the... Uh, She's been a glass hole from the start. Yeah, yeah. That's good. That's pretty great. That's what got it started. He didn't know what a glass hole was either because he hates us. It's, a, it's no way idea. too close to a bad word, honey. My son would repeat that in a different <laughs> format, and we would both be in trouble. Is that your boyfriend? It's like 10 seats away from you over there. <laughs> 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 uh, oh, your brother. Oh, it's a brother. I get it. That's a good wingman. She's like, you stay right over there. But if it's a creep, come over and beat him up. I don't know her. I don't know her. <laughs> we are not together. Have you we guys taken any there. fan questions yet? What? Fan questions are good. That's a great idea. Fan questions. You guys want to take some fan questions? It'd be sure. nice. We got one on the front row. Do we have All a right. mic we can pass around? Uh, I, could, I could probably walk down there, maybe. I don't want to so exhaust you today. I know you got a big day. Yeah. We might can do that. Want to, want to give that a shot, maybe? See? Sh sure. Yeah, do it. All right. I don't want to wear you out. I know you got a big I, day. It, so. it was a comfortable couch. Now I gotta make the camera guy in the back move. So. The couch is really strange though because they're. Oh, yeah. well, we got a fan they're question. Spread apart. They're pleather. All right. What's they your are. Name? They're like sweet. Joey. J your name's Joey. Joey. Joey wearing a Matt Kenseth shirt. That's Which ironic. question? Ironic. How you think you're gonna do tonight? Oh. Which one? Who? Clint or uh, Ryan? Both of them. Well, I have to have. I have to win. So. Uh, <laughs> yes, I've, I've got to pull that out somehow and. Uh, I gotta pull that right out of my glass you hole. Just, yeah, pull it out of your glass hole. Is that still safe you, to say, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, he used it appropriately. <laughs> Perfect. That's why I, I'm not made for radio. I apologize. Apologize what? for that. That was it. But that's exactly that what funny. I have to do: is get creative and uh, win this race and beat that Matt Kenseth that's sitting on the damn pole. It's gonna happen, boy. It's going to happen. Wait, why are they going this side? Why do you... Yeah. Get, oh, oh, they're Gibbs you, fans. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. And Redskins fans, so they really hate you. Because you're up here like, I'm Clint Boyer, and I like the Kansas City Chiefs. Yes. Yeah, the Chiefs and anybody but Gibbs. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> do you want to try and get another question? What do, you, what do you want, Ryan? Talk to me. What, what do I want? Yeah, what do you want? I don't what know. do you want? Who do you shows want? shows up for 35 seconds, and now it's, what do you want, Ryan? I didn't get one question of what I wanted. You just <laughs> threw me to the apocalypse, and hey, here it, I am. It's, it's his show, man. Oh, yeah. We're living in his world. Yeah, I get to come here when I want. I don't have to show up on time. Uh, we can take another question. Who else is, has, a, has a question out here? Right here, we got, a, we got a 14 fan. There you go. Ryan, I just wanted to tell you that we were on vacation in Alaska, and I was watching your first win on my cell phone. Yeah. And I'm wondering what that felt like for you because 
I think the whole bus heard me when you won. <laughs> what, well, what were you doing in Alaska, number one? Vacation. Vacation in Alaska? That's cool. A little chilly. It's very chilly. Uh, yeah, well, it was, it was really neat to get uh, a win for the Wood Brothers. That's been really special uh, to get to know them over the past, yeah, thanks, uh, over the past uh, two and a half years now and get to drive the race car. That was a lot of fun. And uh, to get their 99th win has been really cool, too. Hopefully we can get 100 before I go to the 12th car next year. That would be really special. But um, you never know what can happen tonight. This, has, this hasn't been my best racetrack. It's probably my worst racetrack we go to, so it's nice to not have the pressure of have to go win. Let's just focus Sorry. on not being your best racetrack. Have that mindset going into the night and, well, the and thing just is, work I got, around that. I right? have no worries tonight. I get to watch you race for the win. It's going to be exciting. Maybe you guys can cut a deal and he can help you out. Yes. Tonight. Uh, we all, <laughs> Ryan Spence was like, no. We all, I don't want to bring up old stuff, but we all know how that worked out a handful of years ago. Yeah, you don't want to, no more uh -huh. deals here. <laughs> wow. Okay, let's take another fan question. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> yeah. Hurry! Let's go. Right here, right here. You got a Blaney shirt. <laughs> What's your favorite food to eat away from the track? Uh, favorite food to eat away from the track? Um, I don't know. I like a lot of a lot of food um, of all genres, I guess. But um, <laughs> <laughs> what? Of all genres. <laughs> yeah. My favorite thing to eat, not drink. But yeah, you I could can eat. drink food. Could you eat have Jack a smoothie. A uh, smoothie, yeah, yeah, it'd be good. Uh, I like sushi. Sushi is very good. You like good. sushi? Yeah. That surprises me. Well, that's you. Don't, you can't have it during the week, or you got to have it during the week, not on race weekend, because it's not good can for upset the race. your stomach. What do you like, Clint? You Jeez, look like a I'm sushi guy. I'm from Kansas. Anybody from Kansas doesn't like sushi. By the time it got to Kansas, it was no good. You can't eat sushi <laughs> yes. in a landlocked state. Yes, crawfish is what we considered sushi in Kansas. That's like from the river, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's, well, we don't have a that's notion. That's not seafood. That's don't you? It's river don't food. you? Don't you like suck the top of it off? Not like that. The of a crawfish. <laughs> this is a family friendly Next show. question, hurry. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna grab another uh, another question. One more question. Got a Blaney fan. Hey, I'm Keith from Pennsylvania. Go glass holes for one. Ryan, you gonna be able to pull your dad into this podcast? Maybe. Yeah. My my dad is uh he's not very of an outspoken guy, so I don't know if he'd like to come on the show, but uh, maybe we could have him on, and uh, that'd be pretty neat to get him and my uncle. My uncle's a little bit more outspoken than uh, Ch Sorry. Chuck. What'd you do? We you you would have to talk about sprint car suspension. If you did that, he'd talk all day. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we'd have to talk about something like racing. Like We don't really talk a lot about racing on our podcast, but it'd have to be 100% sprint cars. <laughs> but I, I, I think he'd come on. I'd have to, I have to try to convince him. We only got like ten weeks left, and then we'll have to, we'll have to try to get him on. Do you guys do over. this all year? Do it in the winter time? Uh, Is there like a rating approval deal or something? We, you have to... we actually just uh, ellipsed seven hundred thousand listens. You mean there's seven hundred thousand people listening to us? Yeah. Make fools of like one total another. Listens. Total. It's an aggregate. Episodes. Total. Great. I was it's sure awesome. hoping nobody was listening, and now I'm in big trouble. <laughs> Just pretend they're not listening. I mean, they're listening. They're here. They're they right in listening. front of us. This there is like people. This is like 95% of our listeners You can read their right facial now. expressions. Yeah. with You know you know a radio. That's why I like talking to people, because when you <laughs> run at the mouth and they don't like it, you can read it on their face. So you, you, know, you back up. You downshift. You go a different direction. When you're on the radio and you're in a cube and you don't know your listener, you just keep going. Yeah, you going. just pretend they're not they listening. You could be on the other end going, what in the hell is this idiot talking about? I feel like that's what people probably say a lot when they listen to you. How did you get it? I want it. That guy right there is... What, in the orange? He's, he, I, I think he, he... Is that a jail shirt? How did that happen? How long have you been out? It says Alcatraz. Alcatraz. Right. Did you come straight to the track? Are you the one that was on the fence? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Could be the bird It man. is an awesome Alcatraz. shirt. It was here, wasn't it? The guy on is the that an Alcatraz shirt? Is that what it is? Yeah. I want one of those. I dig it. Hey, next time uh, in Sonoma... You can head out to Alcatraz and get you a nice shirt. Yeah, the problem is, if I wore one, everybody wouldn't think it was a joke. They're like, man, I know it. It was getting bad, wasn't it? Have you ever been arrested? Oh, yeah. Cl yeah, Clint, have you ever been arrested? <laughs> have Dude, you? We're getting into the... This is off the record, by the way. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, you got to clarify arrested. I mean... <laughs> Define arrest. Did they put handcuffs on? I don't on? know that there's like a black and white. Have you ever been arrested? Well, I got back out. I didn't have to wear orange. 
What does so that I mean? So I guess, you know, there's levels. There's what, qualification what levels. What did you get arrested for? How you qualify being arrested? Fingerprints. Is there any other questions out there? <laughs> <laughs> Are you trying to change the subject? Ooh. Oh, if hey, she, we're, she's we're trying driving. to buy you a we, shot right now. We, we drive tonight, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Tonight might not be a good night. If I win tonight, you and I, honey, we will have that shot. <laughs> yes. Doesn't even matter. If I win, it could be gasoline for all I care. Oh. We will have fun tonight. Yes. You got people Jack buying Daniels shots. Be fun. Jack Daniels. <laughs> there you go. There's your answer. Got the question answered. Got another one over here. Oh, wait. Come on, Kings. Shout it out. Oh, uh, one of those. You had your moment, and you wasted one it on those. an autograph. One of those. I'll right. sign it after. How about that? That's like I'll your high sign school. That's a framed picture right there. Yeah. Do people they, ever bring you weird pictures that you're like, where did you get this photo yeah. of Pretty me? Pretty much every picture that has ever been taken of me is, is an weird. awkward, weird picture. Not a very picture. What do you call but it? Do pe but do you have ever have fans that are like, here, sign this, and you're like, where did you get this photo? Yeah. Internet. That's what I'm saying. Literally everyone. Yeah. The Clint's arrest photo. I've There's saw that one. What do you got there, King? Who's your mentor that got you oh, started in racing? Uh, my dad is pretty much the person who got me started in, in racing and, and has been my mentor ever since I could remember. So um, he's kind of the one who, who got me uh, going when I was eight. And he still comes to racetrack. He was at Darlington last week. And he's, he's actually racing himself. This weekend, so he's not here, but he'll be at, uh, at pretty much all the playoff races, which will be nice, and uh, it's cool to have him stick around. Sweet. We have other topics to talk about? Uh, well, I mean, we got one topic that we haven't touched on that Richmond did, which was pretty cool. You oh. might have seen oh, it on the track, yeah. Clint. You know, heading into turn one. Try not to uh, hit it tonight. Did you notice uh, a logo on the wall? You can look for it tonight when you start the race under did the uh, caution see? laps. In turn one? Yeah. You'll see Blaney. Oh, try to have my eyes closed to get in there. <laughs> Scary. What do you have? What we do you got do? our logo it's on the wall in you, turn one. It's a giant glass case of emotion logo you got your banner. Own logo? Free advertisement. That's all Dennis right there. How does that happen? How? Because. What were you thinking? <laughs> because Dennis is awesome. That's oh why. My. Yeah. You! Yeah, he just. Oh, and bowling. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, did you. Were you here earlier? This was my invite to bowling. Hey, you got anything to drink over there at your coach? We're going to come by. They came and got it, and then they left and went bowling without me. He didn't me. get invited to bowling, and he's didn't very. Get invited. But he got invited it. to bowling. No invite. Do you wanna, do you hug? <laughs> it wasn't a. No. Do you want to hug it out? Well, no. No. You? Yes. Him? No. <laughs> Oh, yeah. but we appreciate the signage. It's very, we've yeah, got a, awesome. a lot of attention for it. Make sure you check out the sign out on the racetrack, by the way. So, it's yeah, just, you're welcome. It's getting into turn one. It's on the outside wall in the turn one. If you're sitting on the front stretch, you won't be able to see it. I so. wish last night Brad would have gone the other way. Wait, you know how he went along the wall with his burnout and stopped in front like we were talking about? You're starting nice. to, oh, we're getting, look at this, look at this lady right here. Oh, Debbie oh, Downer over like, here. Rap. <laughs> Get rap. off rap. the stage. It's going off so the rails. We got a rap? I guess. <laughs> you mean so, the big like blue sign that says rap? You didn't. <laughs> well, Ryan, do you want to you want to take us home, close us out? I guess I was gonna ask Dennis, can I rip that decal off the wall tonight? Not with my race car, but with like my hands after the race and take it. Oh, what's gonna happen with it? Yeah. Do you want to take it home, put it in your bedroom? Yeah. <laughs> I just got a new house, so I can just you put, put it, it on the ceiling. Yeah, yeah, right above my bed. I can look at it every night. Yeah. We'll do whatever you want with it. How okay. is he? his own sign. I want my own sign. Get your own podcast. Three. Can I have turn three next year? Sure, turn why three? not? Yeah. I, whoever hits the sign tonight can have it. How's that? <laughs> All right. <laughs> I, Take it home uh, with you, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Appreciate it. Well, thanks, uh, thanks everybody for coming out and listening to us ramble for a little bit. Appreciate it. Yeah, hey, hey thanks for having me on. And, and guys, uh, I, I saw some Wood Brothers shirts out there and, and um, kids like, like Bullet here, they... Uh, They've been carrying the flag and doing a good job. Him and Kim and, and, and this show has been a lot of fun to, uh, to follow. I'm glad I finally got out here, but I'm um, proud of, of you. You're a good kid. He has a lot of fun. It's a, the weirdest thing about him is he has that Blaney, you know, mojo. He's pretty quiet, pretty under his breath. Suave. but he, he's, uh, he's suave. 
but uh, a ton of fun and, and uh, neat to have you on board. I'm glad you're around. Oh, thanks. Yep. Thanks for coming on. Kim, Appreciate even it. more glad that you're around. I'm leaving now. Go download it in iTunes. Woo! Glass case of emotion. We're out. <laughs>